What's going on everyone? Hope you're having a great day and welcome to the Tundra Dude 34 YouTube channel. If you are new, welcome aboard. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, notification bell. You know everything to do by now. Also, I put everything into playlist form, so make sure you visit the playlist section to see all of the 1300 plus videos separated into categories to make it easy on you. Now today is a very important video, one I've been waiting to make for a very long time. Every single day for like the past month, month and a half, I've been going to toyota.com and I've been waiting to see them drop the 2021 build and price section, <clears throat> excuse me, for the Tundra. I wanted to finally be able to build the Tundra so I could see if Army Green will be available for all of the trims this year. Now, if you don't know what Army Green is, welcome to the Tundra because if you're a Tundra fan, you probably already know it. It is on the 2020 TRD Pro. That happens to be sitting in my driveway. It is the special color for the 2020 TRD Pro. Now we know how Toyota rolls. Usually, if it's the special color one year for the TRD Pro, the next year it goes to the other trims. The reason I was a little skeptical in believing if it would go to the other trims is because Toyota came out with something called a Trail Edition Tundra for 2021, and one of the colors available of the four is army green so i thought they might have kept that exclusive to the trail but good news army green will be available on some of the tundras throughout the trim line it will be available on the sr5 limited and 1794 but the only way to get army green you have to get the trd off-road package or that trail edition in the sr5 trim that's the only way you can't just have it on a standard sr5 or a standard limited or a standard 1794 Got to have that TRD off-road package or the trail edition for the SR5, okay? So congratulations to those who are hoping it was coming to all the trims. I would have done it a little bit differently, which we will talk about momentarily. First, there is another new color we have to talk about uh, for the Tundra this year. It's called Windchill Pearl. It has been around in other Toyotas uh, here and there through the years, but it is now coming uh, to the Tundra. I got some notes here and it looks like I may be wrong here But when I was going through trying to build Tundras to see where the colors would be available It looks like it's only available on the Platinum in 1794 now There's no way to really describe this color without you having to see it yourself. It is something quite special Obviously, we have super white available on the Tundra now This kind of looks like a little bit of an off-white with a like a massive amount of sparkle to it It's really cool to see in person and it is definitely one of those colors I would check out if I was in the market for it. I wish it was available on a little bit more than the Platinum in 1794, but as per uh, when I was doing the build and price, that's all it would come up for. So we got the Army Green, we got Windchill Pearl. All of your standard colors are still available. I saw Calvary Blue on there. Uh, there's a little Voodoo Blue uh, still on there for some of the trims. Uh, but yeah, so that's what we got. Army Green will be here, like I said, with the TRD off-road package on a few of those different trims. Uh, a couple things that I wrote down. I like to write down some notes so I don't forget to tell you guys. Um, I will tell you this. As a TRD Pro owner that I am, two-time TRD Pro owner, and all the other TRD Pro owners that I've spoken to, this is always that time of year where a lot of us shake our head. If you own a TRD Pro since 2015, and you've owned a special color TRD Pro, meaning 2015 was Inferno, uh, 2016 was uh, Quicksand, I lost my train of thought there, 2017 was Cement, there was no TRD Pro Tundra in 2018, 2019 Voodoo Blue, 2020 Army Green. This is that time of year where we always kind of shake our head, like I said, because now that special color will no longer be special because it's coming over to the other trims. Uh, one of the things that TRD Pro owners always say is they wish Toyota would just keep that special color on the TRD Pro and not bring it to the other trims, but Army Green is one of those colors we've all waited for a long, long time. I felt the same way about Quicksand. Those are the tan, that, that desert tan, <clears throat> and the Army Green are two very, very popular colors. Cement, everybody loves cement. So, I mean, for sales on the business side of things, I see it as an enthusiast. I'm totally on the side of the TRD Pro owners. Um, there might be some Army Greens floating around a little bit here and there, but I do like the fact that they're still kind of keeping it in the direction of the TRD, Toyota Racing Development Way, by making you have to have the TRD off-road package to have it. In saying that, I would have done 2021 a little differently with the Army Green. Now hear me out on this. Business standpoint, Army Green is available, like we said, TRD off-road package, 1794 SR5 Limited, right? 
It's also available on that trail edition. Now they're really pushing that trail edition right now as something special for the Tundra. There's commercials. I, I haven't seen a Tundra commercial in ages. There's commercials for the trail edition and everything. I think for 2021, I would have just put the army green on the trail edition showing you that that is our new exclusive special edition Tundra. It has the cement on it. That's another color option and the army green, but just make that army green coming off of the TRD pro <clears throat> and going over to the trail edition instead of the other trims to make it that exclusive kind of addition. And it would make people probably want that trail edition because they want the army green. Army green is very popular. It's one of those colors everybody wants to get, but nobody wants to pay 60 grand for the TRD Pro for it. I think this might have been something that I would have tried, but that's just me. Um, everybody likes army green throughout the trims. There, there's two sides you're on. You either agree with me that you would like to have seen it uh, just on the trail edition from the 17 or from the TRD Pro to the trail edition, or you're happy that it's available uh, throughout some of the trims now but that's up to you. And the thing that I'm looking forward to the most, you guys know, if you've been around this channel a long time, I am obsessed with the 1794 edition Tundra. So I really look forward to seeing that 1794 TRD off-road in the army green with those tan seats. I think it would look awesome. So I need you to go in the comments below and let me know if that is something you would buy. Would you buy army green 1794 TRD off-road with those tan seats? In my mind, I don't know how that color combo would go together with the interior, but I feel like it would be pretty cool. And uh, I just have something for that 1794. You either love it or you hate it. Uh, there's a lot going on, but it is the Western theme. And it is just, it is my favorite Tundra trim. I will be honest with you. I love the Pro. I love all Tundras. I love all trims, but that 1794 with the TRD off-road package is by far my number one. Um, if I could go back in time, I don't know if I would have got it over the Platinum, but there's still, you know, there's still time to get one down the road. I didn't want to go from the Platinum to the 1794 because it's fairly the same truck, uh, you know, with the, the difference being the 1794 is the Western theme while the Platinum is your, you know, luxury, but they are of the same level. Just the Western theme separates the two, but not to get too off topic. So once again, we now have the 2021 build and price on toyota.com so you can go and build and price out your truck, whatever you want. This was something we were waiting for. I actually reached out before I made my video uh, yesterday to a few people to see if anybody knew any of the colors or had the list of colors for 2021. And it was just funny that it happened to pop up last night after I put up my video. Uh, so I had to make one today. So yes, if you're asking about army green, it will remain, it will be coming uh, to some of the lower trims in closing SR5 Limited and 1794 with the TRD off-road package or that SR5 Trail Edition will have the Army Green option. So that's all I got today. Uh, very excited. So definitely go in the comments below. Let me know what do you think about that 1794 TRD with the tan interior. I'd love to hear what you guys have to say about that. Are you happy that the TRD off-roads will have Army Green? Or do you agree with me that they should have kept Army Green exclusive to the trail edition for 2021. I thank you for being here. I thank you for watching. So because we're talking Army Green, the feature playlist today will be of the truck that is outside right now, the 2020 TRD Pro Army Green. Check it out. Check out all the videos I've made on it so far. And until next time, I will talk to you soon. Thank you for being here. Once again, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Welcome aboard. Sparksparts.com, Tundra Dude 34 promo code saves you 5%. Site-wide. They have everything, Toyota, TRD, and aftermarket parts for all of your Toyota vehicles. Check them out. Have a great night. Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, Facebook at TundraDude34, TundraDude34gmail.com. You guys have a good one. I'll talk to you soon.